Hello again. In a previous video, I've explained how to set up the uh, 2.7 inch ePaper display using Raspberry Pi and Python code provided from WaveShare. In this video, I'll discuss how to use the display using uh, Arduino IDE and ASP8266 using the GX ABD library to display a YouTube subscriber's count and some other statistics. Before starting, I would like to mention another amazing library to uh, drive your display with Arduino. It's uh, the U8G2 and it supports a large number of drivers and displays. I'll make a separate video tutorial about it, so please check the description for more details and for the source code used in this uh, tutorial. Now. Let's talk about the GX ABD and here is uh, the GitHub page for the library. Basically it, it has a base class that it's, it is a subclass of the famous Adafruit graphics library and the separate IO class for Arduino. According to the readme file from uh, the library you will need at least uh, 20k of RAM to buffer a single image frame uh, I mean um, you maybe need more than Arduino Uno in this case I'm using the ASB8266 Wemos D1 and also I have tried uh, to run uh, the wiring and the code using the Node MCU and the wiring as following the connections are exactly the same for uh, ASB8266 Wemos D1 and the Node MCU. I have downloaded the library from uh, the GitHub page, download the zip file to the desktop and then imported it into uh, Arduino. You may need to uh, close uh, the IDE and uh, open it again. From examples, here is an example uh, using a uh, Node MCU and the 1.5 inch display. And remember uh, to uh, select the display you are using from these classes. Upload the sketch to uh, Node MCU. And here is uh, the demo. It will uh, display a nice graphics. And uh, the 1.5 inch display also support the partial uh, refresh. This is a great option, uh, but it is not in the 2.7. Uh, black, white, and red uh, colors. To uh, run the YouTube uh, counter application, uh, let's install the YouTube API library from uh, Sketch, include library, manage libraries, and search for YouTube API and install the latest version. You may need Arduino JSON libraries, so install it as well. Here is the code I'm using and um, I've included both libraries. I've uh, used both libraries and added my Wi-Fi settings, my SSID and password, and also my YouTube API key, which is, by the way, you can get it from this URL. Simply create uh, credentials and grab your key. Back to Arduino. Upload the code to ASP8266 and that's it. It will take around uh, 15 seconds to complete. You may subscribe now. Uh, you won't find it changing now, but it will uh, change on my desk. Uh, if you like the video, please share and give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in another video. Have a nice day.